Welcome back. This is Dead Space, and I am Shardan, 138. This is episode 17, I believe. And we have to track down uh, two more of those little modules for the uh, for the shuttle. And actually, I just noticed. Yeah, we are heavy on Ripper ammo. So let's go ahead and use that for a while. See if we can build up some more plasma ammo. As uh, as time goes on, this is strange. Forgot there was an elevator on the way here. There seem to be a lot of other rooms back there. I don't know if we come back to them or. Uh, oh. Hmm. Well, I guess that explains where that guy went. He's just still hanging around. Explody guys is kind of a weird thing to uh, threaten the player with at this stage of the game. There are scarier things. Let's see. Oh, there you are. Oh, and you got a friend. I didn't even realize that these were, uh... Didn't even realize that those things were alive. I thought they were just body parts physicsing at first. Oh, contact energy again. Whoop, hey. Take it, Tentacle Skull. Are these guys... Nah, they still got all their bits missing. Okay. What a gross area this is. Hmm. Can I upgrade? Oh, here comes Twinkle Twinkle Little Star again. never hurts to have a little bit more capacity in your weapons. Just because it helps you free up inventory space when all the, uh, all the rounds are, you know, stored in your gun. I have kind of a bad feeling. I'm kind of worried that one of those, uh, manta ray things is going to come through here and make an incredibly difficult situation to deal with. So, naturally, I'm going to do nothing about that po that possibility. Oh, you see that? Who are you? I really do like how these guys just kind of calmly wander around when they can't see you. You'd think they'd be constantly just going nuts, but apparently not. They... What? Hmm. Alright. Contact energy again. Oh, zero G basketball. This could be, uh, well, this could be interesting or it could be tedious. We'll, uh, find out eventually, maybe in this episode.
Oh yeah, definitely in this episode. All these locked lockers. To be honest, I can't quite remember how this is supposed to work. Well, I guess we'll figure it out once we get there. Ooh, level 5 suit. Yeah, I'll take that. What have we got here? Z-Ball. Stand on the lighted platform and activate it. Jump to as many scoring platforms as possible to increase your multiplier. Then use Kinesis module to grab the ball and shoot it into the active basket. Beating each level opens a locker with a reward. Okay, well, we'll do a little bit of this. It's not, uh... It's not critical to the game. But it's one of those neat little diversions. Maybe I'll do just one round. Entering zero gravity. Ah, oh, that's right. That is the, uh, the nav card. That's the thing we came here for. Better gun. Oh, fellas. Okay. My game. This is unbelievable. Ah. Okay. Well, that was a... Uh, <laughs> that was a very poor showing on my part. No ammo for this thing. Hmm, where am I going? Um... Yeah, the problem here is I can't look straight up. Maybe. Okay, here we go. Let's give this a try. Starting game, level one. Come here. It's pretty hard to tell where these things are just because of the way the camera angle works out. Alright, ball, come here. This thing is... It's got to be right near me. Yeah, okay, screw it. I always hated basketball anyway. Game over. Exiting zero gravity. Oh, it's a waste of time. Yeah, the, uh, the zero-g stuff in this game is not great. It's real easy to, uh, get yourself in a position where you can't really see what the heck you're trying to do. Which makes that basketball game particularly annoying, since the, uh, just seeing the ball itself, it just kind of wanders off and goes wherever it wants to go. 
So, uh, yeah, screw that thing. I don't think I even really played through it in, um, the other times I played this game. So I don't really know what the actual, uh, ultimate prize is. Probably a power node, if I were to guess. Oh, what is this? So this guy is gone way off the deep end, spewing all of his this unitology is nonsense. Searching for all these years, this is what we have been waiting for. Don't listen to them. Come back. Come back. How can you be turning away from the church in this vital hour? Do not abandon your faith. What's happening on the colony is not a tragedy. It's God. This truth is even more fantastic. Hmm. Ah, power node room. Let's roll the dice. Oh, it's all ripper ammo. Well, <laughs> I don't know what what else I was expecting, really. At least they gave me some plasma energy. There we go. At least now I've got a full gun. That's a plus. Alright, we got a slidey thing puzzle here. Oh, these are heavy. This area is also, uh... Huh, ah, Ruby Semiconductor, cool. Yeah, this place is a maze. Uh, let's see, I think if I move this. Hmm. Move this. This part of the game feels a little strange. It doesn't, I mean, it doesn't really feel like a Dead Space game at this point. Dead Space is not really known for its, uh, puzzles. It's mostly uh, just shooting stuff. Hmm. <laughs> what? Hey. You doing okay? Nope. Guess not. A necromorph without a head is just a very angry necromorph. Who else is in here? Wow, look at all these guys. Let's do this. This game is a lot of, uh... A lot of kind of incidental stories, I guess. Like, you know, just what exactly is going on in here. You can usually infer it pretty easily. People go nuts, they all kill themselves. They're all uh, unitologists or just, uh, just crazy. That's gonna sometimes happen. Let's see. There's the last nav card. Med pack, okay. Now all we gotta do is just simply. This time, there will be no escape for you, my friend. You have been most resourceful up until now. I do not think... Oh, there he is. Okay, now we got it. What the... Okay, run. Uh, there's our old friend the Regenerator, and he screwed up all my blocks. I 
just going to call him Francine, I think. So Francine is going to keep uh, hassling us kind of more and more frequently. I'm stuck. There we go. Oh, geez, Isaac, run. Come on. All right, I was too hurt. Ah. Move like a Dark Souls style, uh, dodge roll. All out of ammo again. Ah, something right behind me. survive. I'm going. Run faster. Yeah, well, I'd say that describes pretty much everyone on the ship at this point. Ah, perfect. Wait. I heard something. There's something in here. Come on, come on, come on. Yep, this was a mistake. Leaving all these guys uh, intact was not the uh, not the brightest idea I've ever had, but I did kind of want to see what would happen, and well, I guess that happened. This could have been a lot worse, and it is kind of unfair, I guess. Well, it's kind of one of those gotchas that the game occasionally does, where you go into the store menu, and that causes. Uh, Stuff to continue happening, or that that causes uh, like monsters to spawn. But it takes so long to get back out of that menu. Okay, anyone else I need to worry about? Yeah, these guys. Granted, this probably isn't going to happen again. But this is just something I should have done first time I came down here. Okay, now we're good. Now I can shop in peace. Time for the level 5 suit. Now we are fully armored. I think this is a final suit in the game. 
We're getting close to the end. Well, relatively close, I suppose. Okay. Now I think at this point it is time to save. Because this episode has been kind of, uh... Kind of going. And I think there's one right up here. Yep, there it is. So I've been shut in, 1138. This has been, uh... This has been an unresponsive save station. Ah, there we go. This has been Dead Space. I'll see you next time, and thanks for watching.